Hello everyone, Angela O'Hare here, your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And today we just did a walkthrough. Of course, I brought my sidekick Damien. Hi everybody. With me and we are over here at Avery Point, a newer community by Lennar Homes. My clients just bought this beautiful, well, actually they haven't bought it. We're doing the final walkthrough today. This is the Evan floor plan that's at 2448 square feet, three bedrooms, two and a half baths, and obviously the large RV garage. Great little location up here in the northwest part of the Las Vegas Valley, and it is part of the Sky Hills master plan community. So this lot is actually pretty cool, and this floor plan is actually very cool, is because when you sit in the balcony or the little front porch, you do have some mountain views. Love this little front porch feature. So when we do new construction walkthrough, we go through the house, we check every nook and cranny of the house, and anything that we see is wrong, we put blue tape for the paint job and green tape for structural. When you come in, they're nine foot ceilings. Lennar did away with doing 10 foot ceilings over a couple years ago. But you have this nice wide entryway. And then to the left, you have two bedrooms and a half bath, which is very nice. So we'll go around and make a U, circle I guess. So this bedroom is actually a very great size bedroom. It has a light which could put a ceiling fan in it. And the nice feature with most of Lennar homes, especially when you buy a move-in ready home, you have these cool magnetic uh, blinds. Uh-oh, someone turned off the lights. Someone turned off the lights. I'm a little rough looking. Anyway, I like this because it's a Jack and Jill bathroom where this bedroom has access to its nice large walk-in closet. And then they have their own separate sink with the beautiful gray shaker cabinets that are soft close. And also then you can close the door and the person in the other room doesn't have access to you. Or each of you both share the shower and the toilet. And then the other person has their own sink and uh, cabinets as well. I do believe the bedroom sizes are about the same or, or the other one was slightly bigger. Now all the lights you ha have capability of converting it into a ceiling fan with a light. And I like the nice walk-in closet. This isn't as big as the other walk-in closet. So you can see we put the blue tapes. It's actually a pretty, pretty clean job here. Then you do have a half bath as well. This is a decent sized half bath, very big cabinet. Okay, we'll take a look in the garage last as we head in this huge floor plan. Now this Evan is the same floor plan as the Evander without the RV garage or the Elizabeth that has the RV garage, and you can find those two at Heritage. And the nice thing about Lennar Homes is if you like a floor plan in one community, you more than likely can find it in another community. Um, the RV garages have become quite popular over the years. People love having a home with an RV garage. So you have this nice, large, oversized pantry, which is pretty awesome. And then you have the large kitchen. Now with Lennar, usually there's about three or four color options when it comes to the cabinets. There's a white, I do believe a lighter gray, this gray, and then a almost black color. And then this is what, you know, Lennar comes with the quartz countertops. Now, if you want to upgrade these quartz, you would spend a little extra money and sometimes they come with the Calcutta style. Now, most of these homes in this community at Avery Point, or if not all, are move-in ready homes where you don't have an option of selecting anything. But what Lennar does is that the entire living area will have either a luxury vinyl flooring or some sort of tile throughout the house, where and the rest of the bedrooms are carpeting, which is pretty decent compared to some builders where they give you the cheap shit. 
right? Um, a nice thing with this is the large island, and it's a double cabinet island where there's extra storage underneath. Pretty nice, Damien's gonna model for us. They're not as deep, but hey, if you need to put extra stuff in there, you can. Also, this house came with the refrigerator and washer and dryer, which that's sometimes negotiable, and that's why you need an agent on your side to negotiate these types of things when you buy a Lennar home or any model or new construction home. This also came with all the GE profile appliances, the large single base and sink, stainless steel. And if you know anything about the Evan floor plan, this is technically your dining room area. I mean, this is a huge floor. And then this is your living room area, which is pretty big. And they also have it set up for your TV and a Cat 6 right there. No Smurf tubing, but that's okay. They have a little linen closet, or no, a hall closet right here. And then look how big this laundry room is. And usually this is an added upgrade, but I don't know if most of the floor plans in this community come standard with these cabinets. And there's even enough room if you wanted to add your own refrigerator, as well as the nice uh, GE profile washer and dryer. That's something that we had asked for when we submitted an offer. Then you have your smart panel here. Let's go take a look at the primary bedroom, decent sized primary bedroom. And again, you can convert that into a ceiling fan. And the nice thing, certain parts of the Las Vegas area, the communities are required to have um, fire sprinklers. So they have this in this house, as well as they have the setup for the cable, the Cat 6 in the primary bedroom. And again, nice feature. The house already has blinds. You don't have to worry about doing that. And we'll go outside last. Here's the primary bathroom with the long double vanity. And they did the 24 by 12 tiles. Can you open the RV garage? Yeah, you got it. And then the throne room. Now what you see is what you get, and that's the typical for Lennar, unless you buy a more higher end Lennar home where you can customize everything. This is their builder grade tub shower insert and all the Lennar homes in this community come like this. Like I said, all the homes in here are moving ready. You don't have the option. And even if you were to buy from ground up, this would not even be an option of changing out but they do come with some nice general features you know like a, they call this a petrofina which is like a, i think a form of quartz countertops then you have the nice nice size walk-in closet with the builder grade shelving we'll take a look in the rv garage and then look at the backyard next Okay. Look at this bad boy. I think they're about 16 feet on the inside, tall. And you could fit your RV, you could fit four cars in here if you like. The world is your oyster. They also have a standard water heater um, Lennar is probably one of the only builders that still does these standard water heaters. Now, some of their communities, like their townhomes, they will do the tankless water heater. However, they don't do it in the most of the single family homes. Then you, it's plumbed for a water softener as well. But look how tall this thing is. That's your clean up for your RV, your Rainbird sub-electrical panel, your water shut off right there, as well as your fire sprinklers. Go in the back and then call it a day. And in this community, it comes with solar. Of course, that's an added cost that you do have to 
It's leased solar and you would be paying a monthly payment. Most, a lot of Lennar communities have been doing the solar. Whoops. So when we do the walkthrough, we start on the outside first. Usually we look at every inch again of the house. We point out any little flaws that we see. Somebody's cooking something that smells good. And they have a decent sized lot, at least right in here. You can still put a pool if they wanted to. And a nice covered patio with pavers. Now when you buy a new construction home, the front yard is always landscaped, but the backyard is not. Um, the nice thing is they've been doing these pavers. This has the two can lights as well as a pre-wire for a ceiling fan. Now most HOAs, depending on the HOA, they give you six to 12 months to get your backyard landscaped. Now you still have to go through the HOA to get an approval on anything you do in the backyard, but look at those beautiful mountain views. Unobstructed mountain views. So a lot of people don't know, but anything related to your exterior of your house, whether it's landscaping, painting, putting extra gates, etc., needs approval through the HOA. Just FYI. Since this is in the Sky Hills Master Plan community, you will have two HOAs. I'm not familiar what the HOAs are, but you will have to submit it through both HOAs, Avery Point HOA as well as Sky Hills HOA. So that is pretty much it. If you are thinking about buying in this community before you check out the model homes, make sure you call me, get you in their models. I know Lenar has where you can scan the QR code. And if you do scan the QR code to look at the models, make sure you say yes, that you are working with a real estate agent. Otherwise I will not be able to represent you. It's very important that if you do come and you don't bring me, then you indicate that you are working with a realtor, right? That's right. Let Angela work for you. She's going to be your favorite Las Vegas realtor. And who, what's my number? Oh, you call her at 702-370-5112. Again, we're at Avery Point, and this is the Evan floor plan at 2448 square feet, three beds, two and a half baths, and obviously an RV garage. Let me know in the comments what you think of this floor plan. And most importantly, make sure you smash that like button and subscribe. Thanks guys so much for watching. We'll see you on the flip side.